Hello there. Welcome back to Hereford Base. This is attack point number two. This one's going to be for the basement area. And we're going to be looking at this east side wooden wall. Now if it gets barricaded up, don't worry, that does not affect us at all. If anything, it probably helps us a little bit. Because our attention is going to be across the top. Because this is all still going to be breachable, even if it still gets barricaded. Now if you rappel up, you can only go so far across. Which is pretty much just this top left corner of it. But that's fine, that's all we need. That's enough for us to do what we want to do. If you've got ash or someone, then you could clear a bit more of this away. But this is more than enough to give us a good view into this area. And this doorway here is going to be a hot spot for activity. People are always going across there, trying to get a look down the hall. So it gives you plenty of opportunities to get some kills. Some people are behind the lockers sometimes, right tucked away. Or just knocking about down the lockers. So there's lots of opportunities to get kills from here. But with a bit of patience and accuracy, you can be one hell of a nuisance from this spot. And like most of my attack points, you're going to be most effective from range. So ideally you want to bring someone with a bit of scope to them, an ACOG or obviously Glaz. And you can really do the most damage from here. But what's even more of an advantage is that people don't normally look up here. They don't expect people to be looking through this top gap. So if you stay still and you stay prone, you probably won't really be noticed. And when you do, it'll be too late. Just lying in wait can be very effective for this point. If you do bring along Ash or one of your teammates brings along Ash, if these inner grey walls haven't been reinforced, make use of Ash's grenade launcher and open up those holes because it's just going to give you another viewpoint into that main room and that's just going to give you more opportunities to create death in the enemy's ranks. But do be aware, standing out here in the daylight, if you're moving around in this spot, you are quite visible because you've got the daylight behind you. So any kind of moving figure is very visible from inside the basement. And that obviously means that people are just going to spray at that figure and hope for the best. And while there is a lot of escape routes and obviously it's very easy to get into cover and get out of the way of enemy fire, it sometimes can catch you up. So be aware of that, stay cautious and stay alive, my friends. And that is pretty much the gist of this attack point. Thanks for watching, I hope you found this useful. Subscribe for more of these, there are plenty more of these already, so go check them out. Lots more Rainbow Six contents in the works, so keep your laser sights locked here and I will see you in the future. I'll leave you with this clip of me destroying most of an enemy team because that's just how I roll. Stop standing. Stabilizing. Op 4 neutralized. Mission successful. <laughs>